KO-101 is an investigational monoclonal antibody that is directed against amyloid fibrils with the hope that the antibody will promote monocyte and macrophage clearance of the amyloid fibrils from the affected organs in patients with AL amyloidosis. The two studies that were presented, um, one was a brief look at the efficacy as well as the safety of KL-101 when given in combination with Cyborg-D in AL amyloidosis patients. So the safety data was certainly spectacular. Uh, there did not seem to be any toxicity related to the KL-101 when given in combination with Cyborg-D. And that basically will allow now for the two phase three trials with KL-101 in combination with Cyborg-D to go on and in, pa in patients with um, significant cardiac amyloidosis. The other highlight of that study was we had a look at some of the efficacy single signals with KL-101 in particular with the ability to therapeutically clear amyloid fibrils and thus improve organ function. And certainly the data would support the activity of KL-101 in AL amyloidosis patients and improving their organ function. In the second study, there was a pharmacokinetic analysis of the drug looking at the various dose levels that were explored. And in the 1,000 milligram per meter squared dose, which was modeled as the most effective dose, it did prove to show better drug levels in patients who were treated with 1,000 milligram per meter squared dose. And so that, in combination with the safety, allowed for the selection of the 1,000 milligram per meter squared dose for the phase three trials in combination with Cyborg-D.